Hi guys, is my microphone on? Let me check. Yep. <laughs> Hi guys, today I am doing a, well I'm calling it like Pinterest Friday or something like that, but I actually didn't really find this recipe on Pinterest, but it's Pinterest worthy. This is my friend Emily, she lives directly across the street from our new house. We actually knew each other before we even moved in, so it was a bonus to our move. <laughs> Um, so today we are going to be making peach pie because did you guys know that Wednesday was National Peach Pie Day? And then Emily happened to have just gotten some peaches from around your mom's house? or Yeah, a uh, friend that has an orchard in our ward. Oh, so. yeah. So we're going to try this. Neither of us have ever made a homemade pie. Like homemade crust, everything, we're doing it right now. Um, so yeah, we're going to start with peeling the peaches. I hear that's the hardest and most... Uh, tedious? tedious part. So we're gonna start with that. Here we go. a little bit more milk and I think that did the trick. So I got this recipe from my sister-in-law's mom. Um, so Zach's brother's wife's mother. <laughs> and she's like, they like to make pies all the time so I knew they were the ones to go to. And she said that a moist dough is key, like a new Play-Doh or even a tiny bit more moist than that. And then flour it well to roll it out, but don't be afraid to add more liquid if you need. So there's a little tip for you guys that you might not want to take once we see how our pies turn out, but <laughs> I guess we'll see. Place first pie crust over prepared nine inch pie plate and press dough into pie plates. But maybe cut it like, Cut it now? Oh yeah, that's right. right? You want it to fill this up. It's like on Snow White. Yeah, you like. I always think of Snow White when I think of pies. I know. The beautiful cutting job. Yeah. We didn't have two pie plate pie dishes, and so she's just using her normal cake, like round cake pan, so we'll see if that turns out. Indeed. I'm sure it will. these for a long time. I mean, we've been at this for like two hours. This shouldn't take that long. When you throw kids but this in the is, mix. yeah, when you throw four kids into the mix, then. is to have yummy crust and yummy innards. And if it looks happens to look pretty, then it happens to look pretty. Consider that bonus. Yeah, we'll get better. We are now done with the pies and we are going to place them in the freezer for 15 minutes and then put them in the oven. Don't ask me why they need to go in the freezer. Just kidding, we weren't actually ready to put them in the freezer. We forgot to brush them with an egg. This, there's a name for this. It's like bait. No, not basting. Um, Egg wash. That's what it's Egg wash. Sprinkle that thing. Yours looks gorgeous. We'll see. Hopefully it tastes as good as it maybe looks. One eternity later. Hey, am 
mine doesn't look that bad. Beautiful. It looks like so crispy yummy on top. Like I know. That crust that just crust looks. looks This recipe was definitely a win. This is delicious, guys. You have to try it. Thanks for watching my video, everybody. I'm really excited about Pinterest Fridays and doing different recipes and things every week. I'm really gonna try and do it every week. So we'll see how it goes. This pie was amazing. I will link the blog that I got the recipe for the peach stuff on the inside. I'll link that blog down below. And you can also check out my blog at happierhome.com because I think I'm gonna put this on there as well. Thanks to Emily for her peaches and her skills, because she's an amazing pie maker. <laughs> <laughs> so we were actually really well matched as far as our yes. pie making. Yes. And cooking. Totally an experience. Yeah, yeah. Yes. Totally new. So thanks for watching, guys. We'll see you tomorrow, or we'll see you on Monday. We'll see you tomorrow. Bye. <laughs>